Hey guys, so it's Saturday and I am just about to leave. I just got all ready. I'm like kind of ridiculously excited slash semi nervous. I don't even know why, but I'm going to try on wedding dresses. So I made two appointments today and I'm gonna be meeting up with Georgetta and my mom and I'm so excited. It was almost like a last minute plan, which it shouldn't have been, but my mom was like, hey, we should do this this weekend. Of course I was like, yes. Let's do this. It is time. The wedding planning is finally starting. I feel like this might be like the most fun part. So part of me is like, I want to find a dress today because I don't know. I feel like I kind of need to find it as soon as possible. Uh, but the other part of me is like, wait, I want to drag this out a little bit because this is going to be fun. I don't know what's going to happen, but I'm super, super excited. And obviously my hands are going to be busy, so I'm not really sure how much I can vlog it. I might be able to uh, convince my mom or Georgetta to help me a little bit and um, we'll see what happens. But I'm going to try to show you as much as I can. I feel like a lot of people know exactly what they want and they've been like dreaming about it from day one and I don't exactly have that. Um, in fact, when I went shopping with Georgetta, it was like, oh, um, I like all of these dresses. <laughs> of course, there are things that I don't like and that might be the only guiding factors I have right now, but I feel like after I do these two appointments, if I don't find something I absolutely love, uh, I will have more knowledge on what I like on my body. Because right now, I just basically have nothing to go off of because I haven't tried any on. <sighs> I don't know. Basically, can't wait to do it. And I'm about to do it right now. That's such a good feeling, right? It's like so many times there's like so much dread about things and this is one thing I do not dread at all. This is the outfit of the day, a little off-white sweater dress and my little green bootes. I wish Luna Bean could come. I'm sorry. <laughs> So we're done with the first place. It took way longer than I expected, but I had really good luck. I might have found the one. I don't know. They were all gorgeous. It was so much fun. I'm like so excited that it's going really well, but it's almost time for the second appointment and I'm just really excited. <laughs>
What do you guys think? It looks great. You look beautiful in every dress. <laughs> they have to say that. She's really come out of her shell lately. What a big pimp! <laughs> She's gone back to the shell. <laughs> I know, I just had that like crazy, crazy, crazy huge BLT sandwich. But I'm at McDonald's now because I really want one of their little hot fudge sundaes. Why do I love McDonald's so much? I want fries now. This is ridiculous. Nine dollars and seventy. Oh yeah, I got it. I get you, Bean. Oh, oh, she's me. <laughs> Come here, my child. Say hello to the vlog fam. Okay, I got my ice cream sundae. I don't know why, I just had like an intense ice cream slash cake craving at Common Bond, which is where we went to eat after Lovely Bride. They had so many really delicious looking desserts. I wanted everything and I didn't get a dessert, but I did get a massive BLT sandwich and it was so good. Okay, I feel like I have chocolate all over my mouth, but oh well. Let's talk about trying on dresses. It was so much fun. I feel like it went so well. There was only one dress I tried on out of all the dresses I tried on that was just like, I started to put it on and I like took it off immediately because I was like, I don't really like it. I don't know. I, I feel like it was like really easy in a way. It was so much fun, but I didn't buy one today. I feel like I could have though. There were two, okay, I loved a lot of them, but there were two specific ones that I loved more than all the rest. One at the first place and one at the second place, and they're kind of tied for my love right now. And I don't know which one I should go with. Um, both of them, I would have to like kind of change something. And I haven't exactly decided how I wanna do this vlog. I'm kind of thinking, Luna, what are you doing? She's like rolling around and snorting. What's wrong with you, Bean? Come here. I, I feel like maybe I should cut both of those out because what if they are my wedding dresses? Like, I don't want Grant to see the wedding dress that I'm gonna wear. I haven't really decided. I'm pretty sure I'm just gonna cut both of those out, but you can see all the other ones that I tried on. Georgetta helped me record, which is amazing because I get to see like all of the dresses again and so hopefully you guys enjoyed that if you guys like freak out about one of the dresses that i'm not wearing i'm gonna like be so mad at you no i'm just kidding i won't but both of the ones that i really fell in love with are amazing my mom suggested that we go to another completely different place and just see if there's another dress that i love even more than both of those and maybe it will be one that is within the right price range and I also don't have to change anything about it, which of course would be nice. So we're probably gonna go to another place at some point, but sometime soon. I just feel like it went so well and I'm so happy and I love like all the ones I tried on. I love both of the places that I went. Um, they're like different vibe, but the people that helped me were so, so, so nice and I don't know it was just a really fun day and i'm so glad that georgetta and my mom could be there and they were really helpful just like a cool experience to try on wedding dresses um i actually i mean i know i said that i'd never tried on wedding dresses before but i actually have um don't get excited um like when i was in high school i was in like this charity i don't want to say debutante but like low-key debutante kind of organization and at the very end when you're a senior there's like a ball and you wear a big white dress and usually the dresses are just wedding dresses and you just wear them but like it's like a ball gown but you can just wear a wedding dress um so i i have had a wedding dress before but it was not for a wedding um they, it was like strapless maybe i can find a picture and insert it you can see 18 year old leanne wearing a wedding dress 
how strange is that not that any of that matters i don't know i guess when it like before i started any kind of planning i felt a little bit overwhelmed because i guess it was just kind of like fear of the unknown or something but now that i'm really like talking to the wedding planner about like all the little details and everything and narrowing down venues and stuff which we haven't decided yet it's just getting more real and it's just getting even more exciting and i love that i think i know where else i want to go to shop for wedding dresses but i think it might have to be on a weekday because all their saturdays for the rest of the month are booked up and i was kind of aiming to get my dress ordered by the end of the month i'm sure if i go on a weekday i will like snapchat or instagram stories it or whatever and oh by the way i've been kind of sort of trying to switch over to instagram stories i don't know if i should i just feel like snapchat is like dying is it just me i just feel like the people that i watch on snapchat are snapping less and less and people are just switching over to instagram stories which i which i'm fine with that i don't know anyway i'm like surprisingly exhausted today was like such a great day I had so much fun. I'm gonna do it again tomorrow. Ooh, you know what I really wanna do? Is watch Stranger Things. I'm gonna ask Grant if he wants to watch Stranger Things with me. A lot of you guys on Instagram told me about this thing online. It's called Rabbit, I think. And you can watch things together with somebody that's not there. I don't really know how it works yet because we haven't gotten a chance to do it but we want to watch the rest of season two of Stranger Things together. And like, it needs to happen. Like I'm tempted every single time I open Netflix or even just think about it because everyone in the world has already finished the second season and I can't because I've like made an oath that I will not watch it without him. And the last time he watched something without me, which he watched Mindhunter without me, I got really mad. <laughs> it was a serious offense. That's my baby girl. All right, I don't know if I'm ready. You ready? You're on the vlog. I am on the vlog. We can't figure this out. All we want to do is watch Stranger Things. What do we have to do in this life to just watch Stranger Things? I'm looking in the support articles for Rabbit. 